Welcome back friends, this is Solomon Jagwe, I'm back with another quick insight and so today uh, when I talk about move.ai, a lot has happened <laughs> since I first you know, recorded this video right here and if I play back you can actually see there are five actors right now in this scene and these are being controlled or driven by uh, five real life actors and they're being captured using uh, GoPros, you know, all around, about eight of them, okay? So here, you can see this is a 3D version, these are actually metahumans, right? But if I move over here, you can actually see the actual players over here. And actually, the cool thing is these are actual <laughs> moved AI, you know, team members, this is the group, I can see <laughs> the founders, co-founder, and, uh, you know, the marketing team. So anyway, something cool has really happened. So you see, these are five, right? Now check this out, 15, 15 players. And you know what they actually did is they have cameras all around this soccer field. And it's they, as the players are you know, going through the soccer match, they're being tracked. And you can see all over where they're running towards the ball, then to the goal, the goalkeeper and all that. And this is incredible. I mean, 15 without motion capture suits you know how expensive it would be to have motion capture suits and the amount of uh, data that has to be streamed to like from 15 different people but this is being captured by cameras that are staggered all around the the uh, arena the soccer field so that's why i think this has so much potential i mean it's <laughs> anyone who owns a studio or who has done a motion capture suit will tell you that this would be a major, major headache trying to capture 15 people in this space, in this kind of space. Because you have to understand if you've never been to a soccer field, at least if you've been to a football field, this is a long distance from here to over here. So you can imagine how far the data would have to travel or to stream. And even for the cameras to be able to track this faithfully is amazing. This has many implications. I mean, this guy fell down and you can see him getting up, you know, and it, it, the cool thing is that it's capturing the fingers as well. That is what's truly, truly amazing. So anyway, today I just wanted to share with you this amazing, amazing update from move.ai, this new video that they've shared. And uh, please uh, spare a minute to go and uh, subscribe to their YouTube channel if you have more questions for sure. But as I've shared before, I mean, this technology is just going to get better and better. And what is really cool is that now they're working on a, a real-time solution so that you can capture this in real-time, right? This is a, the data is pre-recorded and is applied to these meta-humans, but you can actually see how good it is. And this is direct from the, the online platform that they were, I was able to download and then apply to these meta humans. It's amazing. <laughs> it really is amazing. And then, so now I think the challenge would be for me to be able to do uh, 15 meta humans in a scene, you know, in the Android Engine 5. So I probably have to do like a lot of LODs, like low level <laughs> meta humans, because I can't imagine having like the high quality, you know, LOD zero. Or 15 meta humans in here but that's that's the amazing thing that i mean just the potential of what is going to be happening going forward and so guys uh, again if you're new to my channel uh, do please spare a minute to subscribe and hit the notification bell after you subscribe and thank you so much to all my patrons guys thank you so much for your support i truly appreciate it and it really inspires me to continue uh, creating uh, new videos and whenever i see something on the horizon uh, that can help us as indie filmmakers i definitely will talk about it and share it i know for sure that uh, move.ai has been beneficial to me in terms of uh, the, the some of the testing that I do because I'm always trying to, you know, just go beyond what is, uh, you know, what's on the scene right now and think of beyond the box, outside, <laughs> think outside of the box so that I can see how I can employ some of these technologies too uh, to be able to use it uh, for telling stories and animation. So... Uh, when this becomes uh, even uh, more accessible to us, and I'm hoping that at some point, uh, Move.ai can also make their own cameras, you know, so that uh, we don't have to pay expensive for expensive cameras. I know they are working on uh, 
an uh, like iOS app uh, for the iPhone. And so there's a lot of it that's in the back room that they, they're working on. So please, again, much love to you all. <laughs> Dare to dream big, never give up on your dream. The dream that you know you are supposed to do, not something that you just pick up, you know? So they have to dream big. Never give up on what you, your God-given talent is and what God has called you to, has created you to make, you know, to be on this planet. And I'm always playing, praying for you guys. Please stay safe. Much love to everyone. Uh, bye for now.